Jean. AI detective has two leads for his dog's body politic. Obviously, Albion needs looking into, but I also have a more unusual thread for you to pull on. There's a new hacktivist group on the dark web scene called the 404. But instead of being in it for the lulz, this lot seems to be in it for the brutal reshaping of society by any means necessary. Sound like anyone you know? Guess we've got some ways of going about this then. I've marked both on your optic. I found Street View images of a CTOS hub that's been covered in 404 graffiti. They're marking their territory like an overexcited... Chihuahua. Dropping the location of the hub on your map. How are you doing? I hope you don't mind me getting situated in your safe house. Crime marches on, and so will I. There are still cases that need to be closed, if you'll help me. Ah, uh, cool. I'm all over it. Excellent. I uploaded a case to Bagley. He can brief you on it. Can Kelly's been sending a ton of crypto to an unknown party in Cairo. Something to do with Kronos X. Kronos oh, X? Never heard of it. What is it, some kind of drug? It's a highly addictive psychotropic with a staggeringly high fatality rate that stands to make Clan Kelly a lot of money.
That's the CTOS up there. If you were listening to this, it means you want to learn more about 404. Know what we know. Do what we do. Make your way to the Walkie Talkie Club. It's no big secret that the club is a front for Glenn Kelly, but the place has other secrets too. More will be revealed there. The hub just dumped a massive load of data into your optic. How forward. By now, you must have reached 20 Fenchurch Street. The Walkie Talker Club is located at the top of the building. Lift access only. You have arrived at the Walkie Talkie Club, where those with more money than sense come to lose both. The Walkie Talkie Club is frequented by all manner of crooks.
worked hard, we've persevered, and now we have nothing. The AI is not actually here, just a relay sending the club's data off-site. I'll find where it's all going, and you find a way out of this loud, obnoxious sweat hole. Deal? Deal. I've done some digging and it looks like the facial recognition AI was created by BrokerTech. BrokerTech? They're one of the biggest software companies on the planet. Always keep their noses clean too. If they're buying blackmail material from the Kellys, that's big news. Everything the AI is collecting here is being sent directly to BrokerTech HQ. We have to go there to get the data. You have arrived at BrokerTech, leader innovators in software and AI technology, founded by its CEO, Sky Larson, when she was just 25. Talk about an overachiever. They store all kinds of dirt here, mostly for rich twats who pay to keep it out of the public eye. I say we put it out there. I believe that's exactly what our 404 friend has in mind. Alright, cool, I'm all over it. I suppose I'll keep Just looking. Who's tampered with We've got this whole place secure. It's only a matter of you up. Get it! Engaging target. I'd rather not have to kill you today. Watch out! Shot the fire! No! Shots fired! Shots fired! <laughs> 
You're not getting out of this. Have all the blackmail data and dear god people are disgusting 
I wonder how this family values politician will appreciate his S&M sessions on public display. Oh well, let's find out. Blackmail data is hereby leaked. Fucking banger. <sighs> Unsighted sweeping area. <laughs> Suspect is now in the water. Over. Drones deployed to arrest the suspect. Suspect over. Negative. Suspect is gone. Issue an APW. Nice. We got crypto. Oh, I like that number. I'd say it's a thankless job, but someone just sent us a video link named thankyou.mp4. So at least it's a one thank job. Let's see it. You have completed your first contract with 404, the dark web's first peer-to-peer -peer activist network. I am in the network. I give the contracts. That's all you need to know about me. I'm nobody. I'm not. I'm also connected to your optic now, so let's see who you are. Hold on. Hmm. Are you a dead sec? Oh, this is fucking mint, this. Yeah. That's more like it. Fortune's smiling on us today, dead sec. The world is fucked. And we can help each other set things right. I'm at Somerset House, staking out contracts. Come and find me. Let's talk. Waiters. Well, that was creepy. What's her name, Bagley? I've run Nout's name and face through the usual databases and turned... Uh, nothing. Oh, Nout. Right. Just got that. We're not actually thinking of walking into a meeting with this dark web weirdo, are we? Worth the risk, in my opinion. She seems like a real dead sec fan, and I'd certainly rather have her as a friend than an enemy. If she isn't with Zero Day, she might know who is. And if she is with Zero Day, it's probably a trap. Either way, we'll have new information. True say. Let's roll. Got a potential recruit for you. I'll mark them on your map. Coming up today on the upload.
The thing you're after is around here. What? Oh, him. Yeah. He thought I was trespassing. <laughs> I set him straight. Right. Now, about that message I sent you. I might have been a little, uh, overexcited. Oh, shut up! I've been investigating a massive contract. Too massive for the plebs you use 404. This contract is different. Dangerous. Who is it? I will tell you. But first, I have to trust you. And you have to trust me, you know? So, I'm going to send you another 404 contract. Let's just get to know each other a little better. Look, I don't know you. What's your agenda? What makes your target so bad? Oh, there you go. Asking the right questions. Trust me. I do my research. I know every contract inside out, and they're all part of the problem. London, the world, will be much better off with our help. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have to move this twat before he gets his strength back. Laters. Not a trap. Sounds like we have a potential partnership with this mean, aggressive mystery woman. Give it a think and we'll discuss once you're out of Somerset House. Ah, oh, bless, bro. Unleash the full potential of your mind. Once it will be procedure and you can be free forever. Sign up for our waitress today and join us in the world of tomorrow. Ah, uh, what the fuck do I do? Whatever she is, or you don't take it zero day. I don't see the angle. Shit. I like her. She doesn't fuck around. If she wants our help, we should give it. If you decide to become gig economy hacktivists, then I'll support you, because I literally have no choice. Hmm? 
we're talking about Sky Larson, the enigmatic founder of Broker Tech. Everyone knows her name, but no one knows too much about her, and we only really see her these days as a hologram. She was pretty young when she launched Broker Tech, the company that is best known Auto for drive producing Bagley to the world. Nowadays, it's hard to remember a world before Bagley. Bagley is the most. Auto drive now enabled. Yo, oh, man's live on the scene. Well done. Let me tell you about your contract. The Nexus Tower holds a quantum computer used by Albion. It simulates civilian response to large-scale events. Mass arrests, deportations, bombings. Oh, fuck me. Albion's calculating how much shit they can pull without starting a riot. It's a minging piece of work. Destroy the quantum computer. That's the contract.
you're a natural. Next step is to wait for now to get back to us. But don't wait here. That would be a shit idea. True say. Dead good. Glad to establish a foundation of trust. I'm ready to show you the contract I'm investigating. Go to the GBB. You shouldn't have any trouble finding her. AI of our time, and it's really. I know that she supposedly grew up in the country stuff, but there isn't actually that much more we know about her other than this tech that she's put out into the world. I've always found it a bit creepy that she's so obsessed with this idea of transhumanism. Why wouldn't you be when you've got a mind as amazing as Skye's? Why wouldn't you want to take what you've got and actually augment it by working with technology, by improving your physical self, changing your body and the world around you, implementing more technology to extend your life and really sort of extend human capabilities? You seem pretty much in love with Skye Larson, I have to say. I can't comment on that, but I am a big fan. GBB, once considered the world's greatest public broadcaster, now considered, quote, quite shit. This is where you'll find Alps big contract. I found a surveillance access point on the roof. You won't be able to get in, but at least you'll be able to see inside.
going to investigate. That's where they were. They must be over here. All right, let's go. Everything you are is in your brain. Your love, your fear, your dreams, even the cheeky ones, are all electrical signals firing back and forth between your ears. This right here is more powerful than any computer, but it has its limitations. I watched my mother succumb to motor neuron disease, and her loss made me realize that death comes to us all. But what if we could change that? What if we could scan your brain and upload the neural map to the cloud? Well, that would mean the end of human suffering, of death itself, and the beginning of a new society where war, oppression, disease are all worries of the past. Hello. My name is Sky Larson. I'm CEO of BrokerTech, and this is Daybreak. Now, since all of you have signed up for our waitlist, I'm sure you're eager to see how Daybreak really works. But before we do that, I'll ask the technicians at the board to cut the live feed. We wouldn't want any uninvited guests recording these trade secrets. Daybreak is an imaging system which scans the. There you have it, DeadSec. The big contract. You want to bring down Sky Larson? Oh, I want to do more than that. Problem is, Larson hasn't been seen in public in nearly two years. And he can't kill a hologram. I've been trying to track her down. I found a home here in London, but that, well. Sky Larson's work is changing the world. Her innovations in AI, the creation of Bagley. Is she dodging taxes? Funding fascists? What's she done? Plenty. But you need to see for yourself. A mansion's in Westminster. The things you'll see in there. She disconnected.
quickly. Can you find Larson's home? Of course. I'll just crack open the yellow pages. Oh, look, there she is, right under B, for billionaires who obviously don't publicize their home address, you sweet... Dumb baby. I've narrowed it down to St. James's Square, but that's the best I can do. Well, well let's bell now and ask her. Tried already. She's offline. Now it seemed pretty spooked by whatever she saw in Sky's house. I bet she's got a murder room. Calling it now. This house does not belong to Sky Larson, but why do you suppose they leave their front gate open? Hey, I found Sky's... No, wait. The property here is owned by someone called Sky Lafantano. No E. What are the odds?